I shot you off there. Wait till you see. I don't even know how to join the videos, but we'll give this a go. Sorry for the squeaky seat, folks, but that's just the way it is. This is a wee project I'm working on just now, so I'll just give you a wee sneaky peek. Some things, folks. Because I've been packaging up some of my goodies. Right, wait till I show you these goodies. I'll do this before my other half comes in. I got these, and I don't think I've showed you these. I might have done, but I don't think I have. You see the size of them? It's feathers. And they're metal, they're for jewellery making. Or for anything making that you want. I'm trying to get my ruler out. Yeah. And they're a fair size. Two and a half inches they are. The feathers. I've got ten of the feathers. I've got two of these butterflies. But as you can see they are spider's web type butterflies. See them? Now look at the size of that. That's a fair size. About two and three quarter inches wide by two deep, and I get two of them. I'm waiting on some silver chains coming, so I just want to keep these plain and simple, just on a chain round my neck. See horses? I think I might have shown you these. Let's have a look. Just, uh, I would say about two inches, and they're only maybe three quarters of an inch wide. I get ten of them as well, and they're all the same, all the same design. But don't forget, you can put uh, enamels on these, you can use your uh, Sakura pens on them. I've got my Sakuras up there, actually, I brought them in. And these, see that? Now, I'm no religious person, I don't think that's a religious thing. I think it's more like an angel and if I remember right they were sold as guardian angels and they're about inch and three quarters like just over an inch and I think I get ten of them as well two, four, six, eight two, four, six, eight, ten I've got eleven, yeah so I've got eleven of them We'll see, see what I make with them. As I said, I'm just wanting to have one each on a silver chain. But see, sometimes you're cheaper to buy, or you're just as cheap to buy ten as you are to buy one and get it posted. And that's my philosophy. If you just, if it's just the same price, just buy the ten. I know, but anyway, I bought this die because I didn't have this one in the range. Uh, I didn't have they're from the range, but I didn't have this one of the range. Uh, it's just a wee skull. It's not a bad size. Let's see. One and three quarters by one and a half. Just over one and a half. A pound a die. So I got that one for a pound. This one came in the other day. As you can see, it's from the Alina Crafts. This is a fair size of candy cane. It's four inches by a wee tad over one and a half. And then you get the three wee holly leaves, three wee berries, and a wee bow as well. And I've actually, i seen this, and it was on a backing plate. And I looked for ages to get the backing plate die, and I'm waiting on it coming through. Because I really liked that, and I thought this would be a good easy die for the children to use. As long as you supervise them with the cutting machines, they're fine. I bought these in the range. Obviously coming up to Halloween, you know, for stars and things like that. They were a pound a sheet. That, I think, was... Was it 2 89 or something like that? It wasn't £3 anyway, it was less than £3. I bought these because... These were a pound as well, or a pound fifty or something like that in the range. And I've got loads of tweezers. And I use a lot of tweezers because my fingers don't work right. This is my tweezers. See these tweezers? I've had these tweezers for the age of my 40 odds. 30 year. I bought these tweezers at my first job in a knitwear factory because I was a hand finisher and a hand sewed and these were just 
you always needed tweezers and you always needed snips. And I paid £12 for them 30 years ago, but they're absolutely brilliant. I can't fault them. But I wanted a pair of reverse grip tweezers. And to buy a pair of reverse grip, grip tweezers and some of the craft sites and eBay and things like that, it's £4.99. And I says, oh, I've been poor floors, I'm not paying that. So when I seen this set of four, and I, I'm sure it was only one fifty. It wasn't two pound anyway. In the range for the four of them. Right, I'm going to shift this out of the way to show you this wee thing here. This was some other things that came in. As I said, I'm waiting on quite a few wee bits and pieces coming in. I bought these, this headband, and I bought it in the pound shop. And it looks as if the glitter's going to cast, but I'll spray it with here, spray or something to seal it. And the only reason I bought it is because I want to alter it. I'm going to put like a Halloween bow on it. And maybe, I don't know, something else kind of halloween -y. I just want to adjust it, but you couldn't make that for a pound, so I just bought it. And I'll alter it for my wee niece, I think. She's wanting to go to ha um, Mermis as... What is it? She's wanting to go poppy for the trolls. So... I need some pink tulle to do that. What is these? Oh yeah. I bought 25 coloured bottle caps. You know how I make my bottle cap charms? And I've got loads and loads of the silver. I bought 100 of the silver ones. But I wanted the different colours. Specifically Halloween colours. So I'm quite happy. There's quite a few of them in here. You know there's loads of purples, whites, orange. Yellow, so I'm quite happy about that. Pink ones, obviously, I could use for summer. So I would say there's maybe half of them in the Halloween colours that I fancied. So, and can anybody tell me in Britain or the UK, whatever you fancy, Scotland, preferably because that's where I am, obviously. Where can you buy good? Halloween paper packs from you know what you, graphic 45 something like that a decent Halloween paper pack you look on eBay and it costs you 40 quid to get it shipped in for the states twice the price it is to buy it so I'm looking for good Halloween paper packs let me see here there's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 17 so there's a good more than half of them uh, as Halloween colours so that's good that's fine. And once I've done them, I'll give you a wee look-see. But I've showed you how to do them, so... You just could have a wee go yourself, and if you do them... Tag me in in your video. Let me have a wee look, even if you're not a subscriber, it doesn't matter. I like to see other people's video, and a lot of people put hard work into their ch channels, so... Share the love, it's nice to be nice. And this is a set of stamps. Running man stamps, see that? I don't even know. I just seen them and I thought I fancied them. So that was the things that I bought. That was my new purchases. I tidied all my table off today because it was a right mess. No, I mean a real, real, real mess. I showed you the ones that I had made, didn't I, folks? These ones here are some of the new ones that I've made. See the shaker? Can you see that for a way down there? Wee shakers. I'm not shaking it hard, so a lot of the wee bits are moving, but they do all move. I made that top on myself and I made the shaker element myself. This down here, I made them myself as well. Back to Monty some paper, uh, some card, that silver card. And I've obviously black inked it. I'm going to put a wee bag topper on the top, but I think I'm going to do a spare video. A separate video for the bag topper. While I say that, please go and have a look at, now I think it's Leslie Broomfield, does it now? Do you know what? I'll link her in my description box below. Please go and have a look. She's also doing Halloween in July. And she's I think she's doing 31 days. It's her and another lady and they're doing it between them. 
and she's had some fantastic makes so go and have a wee look go and have a wee kick and see what she does as I say share the love share the support and that's two of the things that I've done if you want a video tutorial on how I've made any of them give me a shout out and a hoi and I will let you know and I will do a video and once I've done my bag toppers I'll come back and show you my bag toppers Right, okay, folks, like and subscribe, share the love, and I'll see you all again next time. Bye.